Hi, my name is Brianna Fitch, and this is Discussion Post 11. Ricky Smiley said a lot of things that I agree with. I wrote down two things I agree with the most. He says you don't have to go around negative people. You could distance yourself because it seems like the only people you've ever helped out and things like in that nature have something bad to say about you. And I agree because there's a lot of things that people say behind your back or in your face that makes your character get like deformed like deformation of character and it can really just bring you down and make you feel very negative and take so much from them people that are talking about you in that way just because you're used to being around them or you feel as if they're joking but they're really bringing down your mental health and making you feel less of what you are another thing he said that um nobody ever got to the root of the problem and they feel as if god can cover everything but ricky smiley said that you that he can't most of the time people act the way they do because nobody ever got down to the root of the problem or just sat down and asked why do you do such and such things like this and they feel as if church can just help them um get better or can cover up their problems when it's not when it's best to sit down and talk about it because this has been a generational thing for so long that nobody has ever got to the root of the problem and they just let it build up build up and build up and nobody has ever seemed to just sit down get to the root of the problem and talk it out in order to eliminate the problem and see where their head is at about the situation that can make them a better person. I think relationships deteriorate because people take so much from other people and not seeing that it's affecting their mental health. When people are around somebody so much, they seem as if whatever their pe that person is saying to them is normal and they can take it just because they've been friends for so long. I feel like it's best to salvage a relationship when people get down to the root of the problem and actually speak about the issue because apologizing and stuff like that don't get really get rid of the problem but it'll be 10 times better if you actually sit down talk about the issue and communicate what's been bothering you because it could be something that's been years and years not just something that recently happened I feel like it's best to completely dissolve a relationship where nobody can compromise or talk about the issue that's occurring. It only affects that person's mental health so much to where they might get dropped or they might stop talking to that person because you're just negative, negative, negative. And then when that person leaves that person, they get 10 times worse because they don't want to talk about the situation that was at hand. The next question was about plagiarism. <laughs> plagiarism is taking someone's work and using it as your own. This is not citing your sources and not citing the author and taking the work as your own. When you know that you looked it up or you found it in your research and you just took it as your own. It is important to cite your sources because your audience has questions and they want to know how credible your sources are. They might have questions about certain topics that they weren't aware about at first so it's like if i go look this up will i find it or how credible is it so like statistics facts anything from the root of your research will be very important to cite because your audience will be curious because if it's something they don't know about they're one to gonna they're gonna want to know the your research and if they can go back and look up if your work was credible thank you